welcome to my channel. In today's video, we are going to be looking at the new Too Faced Chocolate Gold Collection. I did pick up most of it. I think there were some eyeliners that I would just kind of passed on. Uh, and we're going to be playing and swatching. I have been wearing it for about a week now, so I feel like I can give you guys a good review. I know this has been all over social media. I know there's millions of videos out there, but I am excited to show you guys what I think and I'll tell you guys what I think. Uh, the first thing we're going to talk about is the uh, liquid, the melted gold liquid lip gloss, I guess. Um, I like it. It's $21. Packaging is unbelievable. Too Faced uh, liquid lipstick is one of my favorite formulas on the market. I didn't care for the melted latex. It seemed a little gloopy. When I saw this on the video that they released with the makeup line, I'm like, I have to have this. It's the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. I just don't know. I feel like there's there are other gold uh, lip glosses on the market for $21. I feel like you might pass on this, but it might that might be more of a personal preference. I just didn't love it, but I think I'm just not a gloss kind of gal. So I, just take that take that one. Uh, that opinion with a grain of salt because I think it was more of a personal thing rather than a product issue. Let me get you guys just a swatch of it. It is very pretty on. It's not quite as opaque as I thought it was going to be. Like when you're putting it on the lips, you do have to kind of go over it a few times. I was thinking it was going to be more kind of like boom, boom, but I don't know. And I did wear it. The wear time is not amazing. Um... I don't know. It is a pretty lip gloss. I mean, you can't deny that it is a pretty lip gloss. Now, what I do like to do with it is um, I wore like a nude lip or even um, there was a red lip from Kat Von D. And then I put this kind of on the top. That was beautiful. As a gloss by itself, though, meh. Uh, but I do think it's pretty layered on top of a lipstick. But it is beautiful for sure. All right, the next thing we're going to talk about, I mean, you guys knew I was going to love this. This is their Diamond Light Multi-Use Diamond Highlighter. You open it up, and look at this little box. Packaging is unbelievable. Unbelievable. And then, are y'all ready? You open it up, and it's it's a freaking diamond. Can you guys see? It's a diamond. Now, this is beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. It's got so many different colors in it. When you go to swatch it, there's... I mean, almost, you don't want to swatch it. You don't want to mess it up. But it's got, like, yellows and blues and purples. Absolutely beautiful. Let me give you guys just... I, I mean, I am wearing it today. It is just so pretty on the face. I mean, you guys can see. Just, just beautiful on... Let me see if I can get you guys a little better swatch. That's the color... And then here's the swatch of it. It is blinding. A beautiful highlighter. Um, this one is... I'm looking at my little cheat sheet over there. This one's $34. I do think it's worth every penny, too. This is one of those products that I will display, that I will wear, too. Beautiful highlighter. Packaging was wonderful. The inside the box says, it's your time to shine. You get a little box. I mean, I loved this. I was, I was excited about this product. All right, the next thing we're going to talk about is the body and eye glitter, I think. Let's see, it's ultra fine face and body glitter infused with real gold. This is the pure gold um, loose pigment. This is what it looks like. I mean, look at that. It's so beautiful, so pretty. Uh, I liked this. I do. I love a loose pigment. I'm pretty sure it did come with a cap. I just took it off because it didn't pour out fast enough. So, I love loose pigments. I've talked about it before on my channel. You can wear, you can use them dry. I'm just using a little tool, picking up a little bit of it. I'm going to just lay that down. You can use it um, dry. You can use it wet. You can put it on your lips, um, on your eyeshadow, highlight. There's so many little uses for it. So, I do like the loose pigment. My only thing, though, is, I mean, I'll be honest, I don't really have anything, like, when I say gold. Let me show you guys what I mean. I have so many of these from, like, Wet n Wild, these little loose pigments. But I have nothing that's, like, this gold gold. Like, it's it's gold, y'all. 
let me get a little brush and just show you what it looks like. Um, sprayed with like Matte Fix Plus because you can, you know, wet it. Now, last week I did wear this with my Smolder Potion as a eyeshadow and it was beautiful doing it that way. So I do like that you can do different, you can wear it different ways, you can use it different ways. This is with it wet. So there's dry and then that's gonna be wet. Now this is $17 for a loose pigment. I don't know, I do think there's so many different uses for it. Like I said, I don't have anything this color. So I do love this little guy. As I clean up, just leave it alone, Angie. Just let it go, girl. It's all right. Okay, now let's talk about the star of the show. This palette is, this is one of my top palettes ever. I am so shocked by the, everything about this palette I love. Everything. Let's go ahead and get in it. Uh, this is what it looks like. The packaging is beautiful. It's very, it's heavy. It's a sturdy, um, palette you open it up you do get a beautiful sturdy hard mirror this mirror is amazing and then these shades are phenomenal i think the layout of this is what i'm so impressed with when you first opened it up my eyes immediately went straight into new money the pink color and then the green it it was just a rare the way it the way it is set up now rolling in the dough this this is a a perfect all over the lid shadow and they gave you a big pan of that I love it and then the big pan of probably the prettiest gold I've ever seen in a palette or as an eyeshadow and that one is the chocolate gold so I'm gonna do some swatching and show you guys what this what these shadows look like the first I'm just gonna go row by row I know that there's a million um, videos out there on this palette so I know y'all don't need like swatch by swatch, but I did want to show you the colors. What I love about this palette too, these they're so, they're pigmented, but they're so blendable. Like you can do, let me, let me say this real quick. So what, what I like, what I first noticed too, you've got chocolate, cocoa truffle, um, so bougie, boule, so boule, and then the rolling in the dough. These three colors here, and then a perfect black. A matte black you can do you here's your all over eye all over lid shade then you've got a perfect transition color and then a really pretty um, darker brown that you can kind of create dimension you can create depth put it on the outer edge but what I love about it is it's not so dark you can really build it up to get that perfect dark deep brown or you can wear it very lightly and that's what I'm wearing tonight um, and then, like I said, it's a beautiful black. Then you can take, you've got all these different options to wear on the lid. Or you can even take and do like a dark purple on the outer part. And then that light purple like in the middle. Um, one of my favorite color in here is Rich Girl. That is what I'm wearing today. It's beautiful. I've wore it on top of just about every single shade. I love these colors. I love the way they were put in. I love, 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 love them. Okay, back to swatching. The first one is Money Bags. It's a beautiful, beautiful green. Absolutely stunning. Like I said, these colors are so pigmented. They blend very well. I have had no trouble with these whatsoever. I have used um, finger application. I did use my silicone brushes. You guys know I've been raving about these little brushes. Um, and I've used regular brushes, and they all go on so good. The next color I'm gonna swatch is chocolate gold. It's that big gold that's in the big pan right there. It is the perfect gold ever, ever. Just a perfect gold. It's that gold right there. Just a beautiful, perfect gold. Rich Girl, like I said, is my favorite color just because it can go on everything. This is another one of those colors that you could go in with just a simple, you don't even have to go in with transition colors and all that. Oh, I'm sorry. I thought I was in the frame. You can just put this on the eyelid with some mascara and walk out the door. I did that last week. It's such a wearable color. I love that. This next one is Cocoa Truffle. It's the perfect brown, perfect um, transition color. What I really like about this, though, is you can either blow it out. Like, you can make this so light. 
see how I'm kind of like pulling it over here? You can make it a light color, like kind of what I did today, just dust it on, or you can really build up that brown. Oh, and by the way, this, this, this palette smells freaking amazing. Like it smells like chocolate. I, even though I know it smells like chocolate, I do have the other palette. I still can't get over it. I cannot get over how good this palette smells. All right, sorry, we're just cleaning up the fingers. All right, the next one is the Perfect Black. Too Faced usually gives us good black colors. Um, this one is just a good, a good black. Sorry, I promise y'all I'm going to get swatching down. It is a very good dark black. But what I like about it, it's not a scary black. It's not that color that you're gonna, it's gonna take two hours to blend out, but it's still a perfect dark black. I like to use a good black shadow for like um, eyeliner. That I think that completes any look. I love, love, love that black. The next one is Love and Cocoa. It's just more of a darker brown. We're gonna start right here. It's pretty, I'm, like I mean like a brown gold. It's very pretty, very pigmented, beautiful color. Old Money, it's like a rose gold. It's beautiful. I have wore Old Money two or three times now. I mean, just a perfect gold. And then with this gold right on top of it, it's so pretty. The next one is New Money. Now, this is that pink shade. And I feel like these shades are kind of hard to formulate. They got it. When I first swatched it, it didn't swatch as good as the other ones. It was just a little bit powdery. But when I wore it, I was impressed. Like with a brush, it worked so beautifully. I did wet the brush just so I could kind of place it where I wanted it a little bit better. But it did work so perfect. I mean, I mean, just look at how these are so pigmented. I don't know why I'm so shocked. I know the last, um, their last palette the last chocolate palette was amazing. Um, so I kind of knew it was going to be similar. But I'm still shocked. I'm just shocked by the colors, the layout, everything about this palette I love. Okay, let's keep keep going or this video is going to be 800 hours long. This is famous. This color. This color is my jam. It is beautiful. And look how pigment. You guys see I'm not even doing like a hard swatch. It's just that good. All right, we're going to go to Classy and Sassy, another really pretty. This one, I mean, this one I wore on the on the eye. It's not quite as crazy as some of the other colors. It is pretty. I do like it, but it's, it's just not my favorite in the palette. Then So Bougie, So Bougie, it's just that perfect transition color. It's not really going to be nothing to ooh and ah about. Um, but it is, it blends so good. It does what you want a tr transition color to do. The next color you got is Hala for a dollar. <laughs> I can't get over these names. I just can't. This one's really pretty. It's got a good green almost, like a green undertone to it. I already get dirty. Um, It is beautiful. And it's got like, see how it's green with the gold reflex? So pretty. If you've got blue eyes or even brown eyes, this color is gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. All right, and then you got Living Lavish. This is just going to be like a plum color, a little deeper. It This one works really well with, is it New Money? Yeah, this one works really, really good with New Money. So pretty. And then I just placed New Money, this one right here, right on top of it. It is beautiful. All right, now we're gonna do, um, my poor little palette's getting all dirty. Uh, look at her, it's okay though, it's okay baby. I'll clean you up when we're, gone, when we're done. Next we've got gold dipped, nope, I'm just kidding. Next we got dipped diamonds. Now I was really shocked to see a silver in this palette because everything was gold. Um, almost every type of gold shade you can have, but they gave us a beautiful silver. This is one of my favorite silvers to wear. And this is another color that I feel like you can just put on top of anything. So I'm trying not to blind y'all. It's like 10 man silver. Do you guys see that? Absolutely beautiful. Beautiful. And then roll it, rolling in the dough. It's really nothing. I mean, it's not anything that you're going to look at. It's this color right here. It's not one you're going to look at and ooh and ah, but it's the perfect all over the lid shadow. 
I am loving this palette. Now it is $49. I think it was worth every penny. This is one of those shadows that's going to go into my top favorite shadows. And I've only had it like a, like a week, but I have been wearing it nonstop. So many compliments on it. The colors are so easy to wear. I'm, I think I told you guys I am wearing Rich Girl today. It's so easy to put on. Like I said, blended so good. Like, you can already see how much of the Rich Girl I have used. All right, love bugs, that's going to do it. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it was helpful. I know that you see these new collections come out, and you get, if you're getting, like, updates from um, Ulta and Sephora, you see them, and you're thinking, oh, do I really want that palette? Do I, well, do I need that palette? So, I hope this video was helpful. You kind of got to look at it a little bit. And yeah, if you have not already subscribed to my channel, hit that button below. Become part of our family. Make sure you got your little bell on so you know when I'm uploading. Bye, y'all.